Social psychologists have found that performance in any given situation may be influenced by the threat of being negatively stereotyped. Stereotype threat is disruptive and intimidating. The fear is that when facing a negative stereotype, one's performance will confirm that the stereotype is true. The anxiety that the stereotype fosters prevents people from doing their best. It's as soon as you're aware that you could be seen through the, the, the lens of a negative stereotype about a group that you're a part of, uh, if you care about that situation, you could feel some sense of threat that you're going to be treated in terms of that stereotype or perceived in terms of that stereotype uh, or in some way reduced to that stereotype. And it's, it's a kind of threat that, as you can tell from that, happens to everybody because everybody experiences, everybody's a member of some group that is negatively stereotyped. All groups have negative stereotypes. In an interesting experiment conducted by Dr. Jeff Stone, black and white athletes were instructed that they were going to be tested on a golf-related task. When I finish the instructions today, you'll be going into the adjoining room where you'll be given a standardized measure of athletic aptitude developed by sports psychologists and based on the game of golf. The test is designed to measure personal factors correlated with natural athletic ability, such as hand-eye coordination. Any questions about that? When a group was told the task was a test of athletic ability, the African-American subjects did better than the white subjects. When I finish the instructions today, you'll be going into the adjoining room where you'll be given a standardized measure of athletic aptitude developed by sports psychologists and based on the game of golf. The test is designed to measure personal factors correlated with ability to think strategically during an athletic performance test. Any questions about that? When told the task was a test of sports strategy, the white subjects outperformed the African-American subjects. In both cases, stereotypes triggered beliefs and fears in the participants that became self-fulfilling. The cute thing of the study is that he reverses the effect by, uh, in a different condition, changing the, uh, the label for the condition. Uh, in this condition, he says to, to them, this is a test of sports strategic intelligence. So there's a, t there's a, a stereotype uh, uh, that now is more likely to intimidate the African-American subjects in this experiment. And indeed, the performance reverses. Under that instruction, uh, whites outperform blacks. Uh, so yes, I think this kind of intimidation, it's a, it's a, 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 I think stereotype threat is, is a cousin to a much more general kind of reputational intimidation uh, that, that we can impose on people uh, and is imposed on us as, as a kind of regular feature of, of social existence.